If music be the food of love, play on. Give me excess of it, that surfeiting the appetite may sicken and so die. Whether it is nobler in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against a sea of troubles and by opposing end them. We few we happy few, we band of brothers. For he today that sheds his blood with me shall be my brother. Be he ne'er so vile, this day shall gentle his condition. And gentlemen in England now abed shall think themselves accursed they were not here, and hold their manhoods cheap, whilst any speaks that fought with us upon St. Crispin's Day. Sir John, quoth I, what man be a good cheer? So I cried out, God, 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 three or four times. <laughs> now I, to comfort him, bid him I should not think of God. I hope there was no need to trouble himself with any such thoughts yet. Come, you spirits that tend on mortal thoughts, unsex me here, and fill me from the crown to the toe, top full of direst cruelty. Duly loaded his ships and his Argosy set forth to at least four different locations Mexico, the Indies, England, and Tripolis. 
The ships did not return at the specified time, and in due course, Mr. Shylock applied to the Court of Venice to rule on whether he could enforce the bond for the said 453.6 grams of human tissue, or to use the contractual language whether he could have his pound of flesh. Welcome all, children, comrades, citizens, burglars, excellencies, ambassadors, the whole of any price, no matter how much it costs. Without letters, he can't express his love for Juliet as expected. <laughs> Yeah. 
Our revels now are ended. These, our actors, as I foretold you, were all spirits and are melted into air, into thin air. And, like the baseless fabric of this vision, the cloud-capped towers, the gorgeous palaces, the solemn temples, the great globe itself, yea, all which it inherit, shall dissolve. And, like this insubstantial pageant faded, leave not a rack behind. We are such stuff as dreams are made of, and our little life is rounded with a sleep. Shadows have offended. Think but this, and all is mended, that you have but slumbered here, while these visions did appear. And this weak and idle theme, no more yielding but a dream, gentles do not reprehend. If you pardon, we will mend. And as I am an honest puck, if we have unearned luck, now to scape the serpent's tongue, we will make amends ere long. Else the puck a liar call. So good night unto you all. Give me your hands if we be friends, and Robin shall restore amends.